How to Collimate Binoculars Want to know the easy ways how to collimate binoculars? When using binoculars, make sure that the prisms are appropriately aligned within the tubes. Doing so will make them appear clear and not give you a blurred or double image. The lenses should align with the body's prisms to properly collimate binoculars. It will create one clear image. How do you know if binoculars are out of collimation? You would first determine if the object is in the center by observing a bright star. Then, focus on the right-hand eyepiece and adjust the binoculars to see if there is a displacement. It is a process that involves carefully aligning the prisms on your binoculars so that the images they capture appear in one image. How do you fix collimation in binoculars? Before you start using binoculars, make sure that they are out of collimation. It is very important to avoid getting stuck with a wrong calibration. The collimation screw rotates the prism against the spring clip. If done correctly, it can create a great deal of contrast in the image. Step 1. Locating the screw. The spring clips are held in place by a pair of binocular collimation screws. The tension of the spring determines the location of the prism. The screws are located under the armor at the end of the barrels. Step 2. Mounting the binoculars. It will give you a steady and hands-free setup. When you mount your binoculars, make sure to focus on a stationary object. It is the Northern Star Polaris. It is important to focus on this star at night because it does not move as much as other stars. Step 3. one eye defocusing. It is a warning that should be taken into account since looking at binoculars for a long time can cause both eye strain and headaches. Also, you can change the diopter adjustment angle to focus on one eye without affecting the other one. For instance, adjust it to one eye and place colored cellophane on the objective lens. The trick is that the images are presented as one color. Step 4. Looking through the binoculars. To get the best out of your binoculars, ensure that the inner pupillary distance is as wide as it would be if used typically. Use the focus wheel to focus until the image is sharp. If you notice that the star's sharp image is off-center, it means that the collimation is off. Step 5. Screw Adjustment. The easiest part of the operation is to turn the binocular adjustment collimation screw. When looking through the binoculars, use a flathead screwdriver. While holding the object in your eyes, keep an eye on the image as it is being adjusted. Also, you may need to experiment with the direction of the binoculars to get the best results. Step 6. Fixing the coating. You can now put any rubber or coating you lifted back into place after the binoculars were collimated. This process works well by carefully collimating the binoculars according to the distance between the eyes. These will be collimated according to the distance between the pupil and the rest of the ear. They will not work if they are used in the wrong settings. Alternatively, if you're unsure how to collimate binoculars properly, you can ask for a binocular professional's help to do the job for you.